most likely in diagnosis. Okay, and the second last line says melanocytes forming nests at the dermoepithelial junction. Okay. Now the question is asking what type of melanoma it is. Okay. And the second last line here, uh, cell nests at the dermoepithelial junction. That just you know does it for you. you. Read this line and well you know what it is. So it's superficial spreading because uh, superficial spreading uh, melanoma does not cross the dermoepithelial junction, right? So yeah, that's pretty really straightforward. But let's look at you know um, every option. So you'll have nodular melanoma, okay? Um, in this diagram here, yeah, nodular melanoma. So this would be less than six mm. Um, diameter that's not a ball much um, as much as you know that the fact that uh, nodular melanoma has um, early vertical growth right so because of that it has poor prognosis all right next is uh, superficial spreading that we all know about okay that's the most common one okay and this is the one right here superficial spreading okay next is uh, lentigo maligna okay Lenticle maligna is found in um, chronically sun damaged, you know, people like old people in Nogera on the face and everything, like face, hands, and everything. So, then again, this, this is an old person, but superficial spreading is more common. And the question stem saying that it, it's at the term of fuel junction makes it pretty clear. Okay, now a new thing here is uh, the last option that is. Uh, there's no plastic color option. Okay, there's no there's no plastic is something that maybe some of you might not have heard of, but it is basically similar to lenticular melanoma. But the only difference is that there is uh, increased the vertical growth is early onset, so that is thoda um, you know poorer prognosis. Okay, and the last one is acral lentiginous melanoma. Which, uh, if you guys remember, he that is classically seen in uh, African Americans may on the heels and everything, heels and toes. So that pretty much covers this entire question. Thanks for watching. Please give a thumbs up and subscribe for more.